okay guys in this tutorial we will learn that how we can use the relay block or relay module within the simulink so for it first of all you need to click on view then click on library browser and type relay that is r-e-l-a-y and search it out now here you can see your relay module or block so right click on it and add block to model untitled okay and here we have imported our relay module for zoom in use control plus plus and one more time yeah so we can visualize it better now this is our relay how it used to work actually it has one input and one output it will allow its input to be on output or to go to the output side when a signal is above a certain threshold like if we double click on it output when on one and output when off zero switch on point two and here minus two so when the value of input is more than two then relay will switch and when it is less than minus two the relay will not switch so we will apply okay now again we will go to library browser and we will write here constant to get our constant block now here right click and add block to model untitled then this and like this also take display in order to see the output so right click on it and this like this so okay so like this okay okay now we can see that okay now we can see that the input is not going to output because relay is off why relay is off because one is thresh one is less than the threshold uh, two so so if we will click it and and we will write three and now it is above the okay now yeah now it is showing one because because relay is on and it is showing one so we will again write here minus one okay and when we will run it we see that it is zero it is zero okay now hopefully you got the concept it is a simple thing but you can use it in your projects and assignments so thanks for watching